hard feelings to the people of Minnesota. They planted seven or eight bullets in my body, planted what was left of it in the Stillwater prison. So I guess you could fairly say they didn't think much of me. The one who brought misery to our gang was Jesse. He made the whole thing work, being its fire and its blood, but he likewise tore it apart. His grand idea was to ride up to Northfield, take that Yankee money right out of their front pockets. Not a bad idea. If he'd been wise enough to know when to quit, by the time he got out of that bank, I was carrying more lead in my body than that bank carried in coin. It was Jesse who got me all caught up, and I trying to cover his back. Jesse got me caught, too when he ran off, left me behind with the other wounded. The final tally he was the worst son of a bitch I ever knew. I never met a less admirable sort than Jesse James, not in 25 years of prison life. You be careful who you run with. Some would rather see you dead than free him. My eye was twitching like a stinger bee on a gum stick. My trigger finger stiffened up each time I went to pull it. Those were the men, all right? That Jesse and Frank James everyone was talking about. We heard about the robbery way down below Mankato in the middle of the night. They were coming our way. They were bad men, clear to see, crooked in all parts. I had to ride a lot to pull down on them. And I figured I'd get a nice reward from the bank. But what I didn't figure was that, was that I would freeze up like that. I could have shot Jesse square in the back and maybe got Frank the same. But hell to haystacks, what good would that have done me? My body knew what my brain had to catch up to. Even if I got the reward, I wouldn't have been no hero in those folks' eyes. Just a greedy nigger farmer is how they would have saw it button into affairs he had no business in. I let him ride away, out of my neck of the woods, and into another's down the line. I meant to do the right thing, to take the right road. Curious, ain't it, how that road was shut to me. <laughs>